Hello everyone, welcome to Satic GK quiz number 220. This video is aimed to help you with your state and central government exams like SSC, UPSC, state PSCs and banking and insurance related examinations like RRP, IBPs, etc. I'm Nitrisha from GK today and I'll be taking you through this. A number of factors are responsible for poverty in India. Which among the following is not the economic factor contributing to poverty? Correct answer is inequalities of income. As of November 2016, India is the second most unequal country in the world after Russia. The richest 1% of Indians own 58.4% of wealth. The richest 10% of Indians own 80.7% of the wealth. This trend is going in the upward direction every year, which means the rich are getting richer at a much faster rate than the poor. Which among the following sentence is or are correct? Among the given options, option A, the union levies, collects and distributes the proceeds of income tax between itself and states is correct. Taxes in India are levied by the central government and the state government. So minor taxes are also levied by the local authorities such as municipalities. Therefore, each tax levied or collected has to be backed by an accompanying law passed either by the parliament or the state legislature. In which of the following situations the investment will increase? The correct answer is when there is an increase in output and increase in capital stock. Over the years, India has emerged as one of the fastest growing economies in the world and an attractive investment destination driven by economic reforms and a large consumption base. It was the fastest growing major economy in 2017-18 with its GDP growing 7.2% and reaching Rs 170.95 trillion. It is expected to grow at 7% in 2018-19. Which among the following is a direct tax? Correct answer is income tax. Direct tax is a tax directly paid to the government by the individuals or organizations on whom it is imposed. The main examples are income tax, gift tax, wealth tax, etc. Which among the following is a progressive tax? Correct answer is income tax. In progressive taxation, the tax liability increases with individual or entity income. This is based on principle of ability to pay. Under this system, lowest income people are generally exempted while highest income people pay highest taxes. Income tax is thus an example of progressive tax. Progressive taxation results in redistribution of income from rich to poor. All commercial banks, including branches of foreign banks functioning in India, local area banks and regional rural banks are insured by DICGC. What is the full form of DICGC? Correct answer is Deposit Insurance and Credit Guarantee Corporation. So Deposit Insurance and Credit Guarantee Corporation is a subsidiary of Reserve Bank of India and was established on 15 July 1978 under Deposit Insurance and Credit Guarantee Corporation Act 1961 for the purpose of providing insurance of deposits and guaranteeing of credit facilities. DICGC insures all bank deposits such as saving, fixed, current, recurring deposit for up to the limit of Rs 100,000 of each deposits in a bank. Which among the following is correct regarding currency chests? Correct answer is storehouses where bank notes and rupee coins are stocked on behalf of the reserve bank. So, uh, currency chests are branches of selected banks authorized by the RBI to stock rupee notes and coins. The responsibility for managing the currency in circulation is vested in the RBI. Rupees 100 notes are printed in which of the following? Correct answer is in the Indian Security Press Nasik, the Security Printing Press Hyderabad as well as the Banknote Press in Divas. The India government mint operates four mints in the country for the production of coins. Each currency coin minted in India and anywhere else in the world has a special mint mark on it to identify the mint. Which among the following taxes is levied by state government only? Correct answer is entertainment tax. In India, entertainment tax is levied on every financial transaction that is related to entertainment such as movie tickets, major commercial shows and big private festivals. As per the Indian constitution, entertainment is included in list 2. The revenue is thus reserved primarily for the state governments. That's all for today's quiz. Until the next video, goodbye.